This video is sponsored by Tenorshare. Hey guys, this is Shivam and welcome back to the channel. And today I'm going to show you how you can uninstall Cydia and how you can unjailbreak your device. If you are using CheckRain or maybe if you are using Uncover, so both of them I'm going to cover in this video. So make sure you watch this video till the end and let's get started. Tenorshare for you key to unlock disable iPhone without using iTunes. It unlocks iPhone, Apple ID and lock screen, touch ID and face ID. It bypass iPhone password instantly. You can get Tenorshare for you key software on Mac and Windows. Check out the website link in the description below. So first thing first, if you have a jailbroken with the CheckRain, open CheckRain and you can see the CD app where you can uninstall and uh, install the CD app. So anyway, you can see that red button which is the restore system. So there we go, you just click on it and now you can uninstall jailbreak files and other um, uh, changes made of the operating system without erasing your data and all that. Just hit restore system, your mobile will restart. So as you can see, the CDI is gone completely and now you are in a iOS stock mode completely. So now you are no longer jailbroken uh, mode. So that's a very simple trick to uninstall CheckRain from your device and uh, that's where you can remove Cydia. Now next step I'm going to show you on Uncover how you can remove Cydia and unjailbreak your device using Uncover. In case your Uncover is re uh, revoked and you are no longer getting Uncover so wait for the certificate to sign and then you can install Uncover and then you can follow this method. Now go to the Cydia and as you can see I'm um, I'm using Batchomatic to back up my all the tweaks and repo which I already had before jailbreaking. So with this tweak you can literally uh, back up everything from your uh, device uh, about jailbreaking stuff and you can restore them without any anything losing. I already made a dedicated video on this. Uh, check out the link in the description or uh, at the right corner i button in case you want to back up the tweaks. Now head over to uncover and there we go you just go to that gear button at the right corner and click on it and now if you scroll down you can see um, first thing first we're gonna on restore root fs and toggle that on so once it is done the next step we're gonna need to on uh, i mean disable is disable updates so make sure you disable updates because if you do that you will get update from your um, setting button uh, when you are upgrading to the next um, iOS system. So once you've done that, you will get that restore root FS on the screen at uh, blue button. Now you are ready to um, remove your jailbreak stuff. So click on restore root FS and you will get this not notice. We'll restore root FS and this may take a while. Don't uh, exit from the app and all that. So keep continue and it will restoring all the uh, files and all that it will remove from the system and once it is done you will get another notice it has been successfully restored and now device will be restarted once the device is restart now uh, as you can see uh, your device is completely on iOS stock mode there will be no Cydia and no jailbreak stuff all the tweaks are removed already now you are completely uninstalling all the jailbreak stuff and this is the only way you can remove the Cydia from your system you can't just uninstall that without an uncover app so hope you understand and now uh, you are free to upgrade your device to the next iOS uh, firmware whichever uh, presently uh, running so hope you understand guys and if you are new to this channel um, make sure to subscribe my channel and hit that bell icon to get notified and now you're ready to remove all the jailbreak apps and all that and now I'm, I'm gonna be showing uh, how you can upgrade your device by going to the setting and uh, simply go to the general and you can see in about I'm running on iOS 13.3 and now you can whatever version you are doesn't matter and now you can simply upgrade your device by automatic upgrade and there we go uh, 3.5 but currently uh, is iOS 14 beta uh, running and iOS 13.5.1 maybe most of the people are there maybe in future you are going to upgrade to the iOS 14 so the same method is going to apply for all the um, firmware in future 
सो होप यू गैज अंडरस्टैंड आई आल कैच यू इन द नेक्स्ट वीडियो दिस इज शिवम साइनिंग ऑफ एंड इट्स ऑलवेज पीस